Carrick Winky here. It's episode 25 of Seven Slaps in the Sack with my guy Sneak Guapo. Yeah, man. What's up with you guys, man? How you guys feeling? Feeling great. I've uh, actually been a friend and a fan of Sneaks for a pretty long time. We did our his first interview ever. I conducted in 2014, and it was actually like two blocks away. And it was for, but it was underground hype. It wasn't Seven Slaps. But now we're boomed up, and we're about to go in there. We're about to pick out some slaps, you know. Take out some shit, man. I'm gonna show you guys some shit. Look, I had to beg my guy Carrick right here to get <laughs> on Seven Slaps, man. You know what I'm saying? Sneak Wobble himself had to beg Carrick, man. You guys believe that shit? Nah, so, I ain't shit. You didn't have to beg nothing. <laughs> All right, Guap's got his picks here. Looks like uh, he, we had a little bit of a hard time finding a few things, but it's all good because we got it now. So. What episode is this? 25. But I'm not 25. He's not 25. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, what's up, man? You know, Sneak Guap, man, and this motherfucker. You know, I got to go with the, uh, you know what I'm saying? First, I had to. I kind of had to line them up a little bit, you know what I'm saying? First, I'm going to go with the T.I. in this motherfucker, you feel me? T.I., man, I was a young nigga, you know what I'm saying? Wasn't really in too much trouble, but T.I., you know what I'm saying? I was slapping T.I. I remember I was with my older bro, big truck driving, slapping Impala 12s in the back, all this shit, you know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, T.I., had he got that heat on there. You know, that motivation, you don't know me, ASAP, you know what I'm saying? Like, all that's going to really bust your eardrums, you know what I'm saying? Slapping that T.I., you know what I'm saying? Plus, I low-key be watching T.I. and Tiny, you know what I'm saying? Low-key, don't tell nobody. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I got cable, yeah. Trap house. And then I feel like this is cliche, but you know what I'm saying? Everybody always got to go with the, you know, the Nirvana, you know what I'm saying? Just only for the simple fact of I didn't really grow up listening to this shit, but you know what I'm saying? He changed a lot of shit in Seattle, you know what I'm saying? And he influenced me and everybody that's around me, you know what I'm saying? Whole Thrax house, whole more gang movement, you know what I'm saying? I didn't really listen to him growing up, you know what I'm saying? I, 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 you know, I'm a black kid, you know what I'm saying? I'm listening to Nirvana, but I grew up in, you know what I'm saying, touch bases with this whole, this whole situation. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Shout out Kurt, man, you know what I'm saying? Stay positive. We in Seattle on this motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? West Seattle. Uh, number three, you know what I'm saying? I got, uh, man, look, they won't let my bro out, you know what I'm saying? I grew up really listening to him. I couldn't find Master P, you know what I'm saying? Master P is really who I was listening to, but we're gonna go with the C murder. You know what I'm saying? Sad situation, man. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I was watching his little movie, his little documentary that he got. You know, sad situation, man. Uh, free C murder, man. You know what I'm saying? Master P, you need to talk to your brother. You feel me? I know. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? C murder. That's uh, number three. Now we're going to get a little bit more technical. You know what I'm saying? These guys, you know what I'm saying? I... I listen to them mainly, you know what I'm saying, but these things right here, you know what I'm saying, a lot more technical. We're going to go with this. What's this, four? Yeah, it's number four. We're going to go with this. Lil Wayne, you know what I'm saying, the Carter Two, you know what I'm saying. From what I remember, I was slapping the Carter Two. Me and my bro, my older bro, he had, he put me on a lot of shit. He put me on the Jacka. He put me on with, you know what I'm saying, a lot of shit. And Lil Wayne is one of them, you know what I'm saying. Just got a lot of slaps, you know what I'm saying? Money on my mind, because money is all I think of. You know what I'm saying? You guys got to tap in with this motherfucker. Best rapper alive. Do you guys know this? Lil Wayne is the best rapper alive? Yeah. But do you know this album? When did that come out? 2006? Five. See, that was when I made the switch from rap to rock. There was a bit like, 2005 was the last year I listened to rap, and I was listening to rock until like 2007. 2007? So... I fuck with rock, but I didn't really grow up listening to it, you know what I'm saying? I wish I did. I wish I had more of a horizon to open up music-wise and music choice, but I listen to a lot of rap, you feel me? I basically... Oh, what you say? I stopped listening to... I was, like, listening to rap in, like, the Lil John era and shit like that, and, like, I, I, like, gave up on that, and I started listening to rock, and I listened to a lot of, like, like grunge. Like, I don't even like to call it grunge, because that's just, like, a false statement, but, like, I listened to a lot of, like... Guns N' Roses and like Nirvana, Alice in Chains and shit like that until like I started skating in like 2007 and we would slap hella underground rap and like hella UGK. Like all I listened to was like Guns N' Roses, UGK, 3-6 Mafia, like Nirvana, Alice in Chains. 
Del the Funky Homo Sapien, shit like that. 2007? 2007. I started skating in 2008. You guys didn't even know. I really used to be all right at the yeah. skate, you know what I'm saying? I used to be Mr. Kick Flip down the stairs. Boom! Yeah. <laughs> then I became a gangster, now I'm a rapper. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna keep it lit. Like Same. Yeah. Sorry, I'm not a gangster, I'm positive, you know what I'm saying? We are icy boys, though. We're all oh, icy yeah, boys. Oh, yeah, I see you. Yeah, man, we got a lot of, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. A lot of this. Right, I see it. That Lil Wayne changed my life. I swear to God, it changed my whole life. I probably cried to this, I ain't gonna lie to you. Just because it was just so perfect. Did you like Lil Wayne's rock album? I didn't listen to it. I ain't Nobody did. Yeah. No one did. No I didn't one. listen to it. Uh, she was but Cheeks. It was Cheeks? Yeah, hell yeah. But I fuck with you, Lil Wayne, bro. And I know you're going through some shit right now. Shout out to Lil Wayne. You're probably going to watch this. You know what I'm saying? Because I'll sign you, bro. If you call me, <laughs> bring a check. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I'll yeah. sign you, Lil Wayne. You know what I'm saying? All right. This next one, we're on a... Uh, what is this, five? Number five, yeah. We're on five. Now, this is real emotional to me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Regular. Has anybody pulled this album out? The last episode, Stunna Man pulled that out, yeah. <laughs> Come on, Stunna. Come on, Stunna Man. But you probably know. Stunna probably knows, man. But this it's timeless, though. Timeless, bro. You know, This is great as hits, but you know what I'm saying? This is banger after banger. You know what I'm saying? I probably cried this as a kid. I was probably like fifth grade listening to this crying. You know what I'm saying? I'm an emotional person. You know what I'm nah, I'm lying. I ain't emotional, but <laughs> the music gets me emotional. That's why my music is emotional. I learned from Two Pizzle, you know what I'm saying? Two Pot, you know what I'm saying? Sad moment, you know what I'm saying? Death Row Records, you feel me? Shout out. We're on six. Now, I remember, man, this just had woke me up, you know what I'm saying? This is sad, you know what I'm saying? I gotta go with, you know what I'm saying? The Whitney. That Whitney is incredible. That lady is cre incredible, you know what I'm saying? That lady can really sing, you know what I'm saying? I would listen to Whitney Houston and listen to Nicki Minaj, all that. Like, I'm talking about the Whitney Whitney before she really started going real crazy. Like, I wanna dance with somebody? Come on. That's emotional. Yeah. Like, give a moment of sadness <laughs> for Whitney Houston, man. I got a tribute coming out with Camden Mack. You know what I'm saying? I got them hundreds and fifties. You know what I'm saying? I will always love you like Whitney. It ain't on here. But you know what I'm saying? I will always love you like Whitney. That's a nice slap. You guys need to go listen to that shit. You might cry, you know what I'm saying? We're on seven. Hold up. Woo, let me put the secret yeah, back. We, we got a secret slap to him. Um, we're going to go with this. Uh, we're on seven, but I got a little bonus project for you guys. We're going to go with Aaliyah. You know what I'm saying? This motherfucking album is incredible. I remember when she died, I cried. I'm not going to lie to you. I cried. You know what I'm saying? But I'm a gangster, though. You know what I'm saying? I was, it, was, it was thug tears. You know what I'm saying? I was young. That's just when I was really in the West. I remember I was at my Uncle Don's house, man. R.I.P. my Uncle Don. And I cried when she, when she died in the plane. You know what I'm saying? Just has nothing but slappers on it. That picture goes hard, too. Oh, uh, yeah. I want those glasses. I'm gonna I just get want one. her. Just come back. Me, too, bro. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, bro. We got the last, the secret slap. Secret slap in the sack. Other motherfucking day, you know what I'm saying? Other year, excuse me. We're gonna go with that. Uh, Sneak Guapo. I never really, I don't really know this dude too much. You know what I'm saying? I know he goes by Guap, and he just dropped an album called Burn Unit. You guys need to wake up, man. You guys need to go, you know what I'm saying? That Burn Unit really burn your face off. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Go slap Europe with the vibes. Europe with the vibes and kind of check up. You feel me? Never heard it though. Yeah, man. You know, a lot of work into this shit. Shout out to Ozone, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to everybody that was incorporated in this album. You know, shout out to Ned, you know what I'm saying? He did a great job on that. You know what I'm saying? That uh, used to be like this, but I never listened to it though. You know what I'm saying? Uh, shout out to Wave Real, you know what I'm saying? And that's my little slaps. You know what I'm saying? That's all I got. I got two two and one slap right here. Do you want to hold the mic? Yeah, I'm going to hold you the wanna, mic. Do you want to interview me? All right, man, look. Now this is Sneak Wop interviewing my guy, Carrick. You know what I'm saying? We're going to keep it positive in this motherfucker. Let me know what you got, bro. All right. So I got two Sir Mix A Lot albums. The reasons why I picked those is because people don't know Mix actually has bars. He goes, Ham, you look like you're judging right now. It's no, chill No, it's fine. I really See, mix a lot. Like, I really I had to pick it. the pot. I had to pick the Swass because he's got Posse on Broadway, and we're one block away from Broadway right now. Yeah. And he's on, he's on here. He's holding the Space Needle with his hand. And then on this one, we got Seminar, which has got my hoopty on it. We also used to slap my hoopty when we were skating and shit. Oh, yeah. And fucking, he's got, look at all the ice. He's ca literally carving a, carving like a contract into a piece of stone. And just like, 
Like, man, dude's on the on the phone. He's about to go pick some bricks up or something, you know? Like, let me see this. I just hey, this is who we look up to. It. Everybody, man, we walk around with all this gold on. This is who we look up to. These guys. Literally, right sir, makes a lot. He should be on the episode one day. Yeah, he's a, yeah. We gon' we gonna call him. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if he fucks with me, but we gon' we gonna call. <laughs> I don't know if he fucks with me either. He probably doesn't. He's giving me a dirty look in this picture. So, yeah, but yeah those are the uh, those are our slaps. Go on Sneak Wapo's Bandcamp. Download all of his old stuff too. Lighthouse on Jupiter. Um, what else? What's Man, the first one? Suicide, uh, Suicide Capital. Capital. You know what I'm saying? Man, how could I forget? I, yeah. I purchased all of his albums, so you should too. He did. Support. I swear to God, I got the email. I was like, yeah. whoa. You know what I'm saying? But look, man, shout out to Carrick, man. Shout out to Wiggy. Don't act like I don't see you right there, boy. Wiggy you know what I'm saying? The Wiggy behind the camera, man. You know what I'm saying? Free my bros, West Seattle. You know what I'm saying? Morgan Thrax House. You know what I'm saying? Free Marty, free Michi, man. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate everybody, man. Hell yeah. Gang, gang. Ice style. Woo, woo. Ice style. Ski, ski.